I've decided to heal the world and no one can stop me. I've already been doing it for more than a year now, but I'm going to continue on. Um, we've all seen that something was happening in the world and we're wondering who's the cause of this? Why is there so much destruction going on? Why did we have having wars and people starving and why do we have all this conflict and fighting? It's because of you. Yeah we're all equally responsible because see we're all born to offer something to the world and it's within us but we're also born with restrictions and limitations that we have brought in they're generational we've brought them in from our families our parents our countries wherever we lived or whatever that might be and so we have to move through those things within ourselves if we expect to see the world any better no one was given any more power than you no one has any more ability than you, but we don't always accept that. I didn't accept it. I had to move through all of this myself, but that's why I can give this back to others, which is why no one can stop me. When I saw that my life, everything that I moved through and what I discovered and all the work that I've done these many years has come to m giving me the ability to create something that can help others, I've got to do more of that. See, because we limit ourselves, we will look at all the different things that are happening and think it's the politician's fault that this is happening. It's because of these other group of people, they're causing all the problems. No, it's you. It is you. Because see, if you're not happy, if you're not really thriving, if you're not prosperous, if you're not successful in whatever that means for you, then you are contributing to the problem. Because we also know now how we create our world. It's energetically. We know this through the quantum sciences. If you study any of that, there are always discoveries made about how we create our lives, our individually create our lives, our reality, and how we add that to our world, because it's a collective venture that we're all on. So if you're not living this magnificent life, then you're contributing to the problem. And I wasn't living fully my magnificent life, and I was contributing to the problem because I was holding back, as you might have done. We don't know what we have when we come into the world, and we don't know what conditions are going to be in the world, because then it starts to unfold. It starts to awaken within us. And I'm calling this a spiritual revolution that we are moving through in our world. And the only way that we cause our world to be better is through you. By you deciding to own who you are, giving back to the world whatever gifts you have, because everyone has them. And see, that's the point that it, it makes it difficult, because a lot of people don't believe that but that's where they are then adding to the destruction of our world because they're not honoring their value. I've gone through this for so many years, so I see it all the time. I see people struggling to find happiness, to find the right relationship, the right career, all of that, because they haven't been given the tools to understand what that is. I've created the tools, and it's just about taking you on this deep dive, this dive of self-discovery, to unlock your genius because it's within you it's in every single person and it has so been so thrilling for me to watch this happen over the last year more than a year now to see folks completely transforming because of what i went through because of what i developed because what i was able to create and everyone has something like that within them but we come in at different times and diff in our lives and different parts of our own evolution because we each have our ev evolutionary journey it's individual for each person and you have to decide I'm going to step through this next little bit of resistance I'm going to step through this next bit of fear that I've been carrying about myself see because if you have any thoughts that you are not as powerful and as brilliant as some other person then you haven't discovered who you are and if you think that you are better than other people in some way you still haven't discovered who you are because that's never true you are no no better than anyone else and no one is better than you and see when more of us come to understand that that's how we heal our world all the old stuff that we brought in is old stuff we don't have racism we don't come in being racist we learned that and so w when you see people or you know the white supremacy and all of that that's going on they didn't do that on purpose they were taught that and so we change that energetically when we decide oh I'm going to love who I am and I'm going to do what I came to the world to do our world changes 
not going to happen tomorrow, but it will happen. And I'm already seeing it. And I can see the difference that this work has made in my life and in the lives of others. So that's what I have to offer. That's how I'm going to, to help heal the world. And I'm not doing it by myself. I have this other team that's working with me. I have this other great coach who can work on men's issues like you can't believe and guide them to understanding who they are and why they're in the world. Then I have this really young healer who can take you through such great meditations and release all this blocked energy that's within you. Yeah, so it's all of us together, and that's what's happening. And that's how we are going to help heal the world. Now, to show you this, we're going to do a presentation. There'll be several of them, but there's one uh, coming up next Wednesday depending on when you happen to see this, uh, where we're going to just demonstrate and show you exactly how we've been able to accomplish this and how it can work for you because you deserve to live this magnificent life. And if you're living anything less than that, you've just not discovered who you are. That's all. And it's time now.